Hey, welcome back to the channel. My name is Keith and I'm sure glad you stopped by today. In today's video, we're going to show you how you can remove and replace the belt on your upright vacuum cleaner. Um, so typically, you know you're going to probably need to replace your belt if your vacuum cleaner is no longer picking up uh, debris and trash off the floor like it should, or if you look down and when you have the vacuum cleaner on, this brush down here is no longer spinning. If any of those things are happening to you, it may be time for you to replace your belt. So we are working on a Bissell upright vacuum cleaner today. These steps are gonna pretty much be applicable to um, a lot of different upright vacuum cleaners. So if you don't have a Bissell, you can still apply these steps to the vacuum cleaner that you have. So step number one, make sure the vacuum cleaner is unplugged. And we've done that. So step number two, let's flip this over. So we've got our vacuum cleaner flipped over now. Um, let's talk about a few parts we see. This is the motor. This is the brush. You're gonna need uh, probably a Phillips head screwdriver to remove these screws. We wanna take this plastic piece right here off. So I'm gonna use my Phillips head screwdriver to remove all these screws. You can use a screwdriver. I'm gonna use my electric drill to save a little time. I've got my cordless drill. Let's go ahead and remove these screws all the way around. We've got all our screws removed, so let's go ahead and remove this plastic piece. So let's talk about a few of the different parts here. This is the motor. This metal piece coming off right here is uh, attached to the belt. The belt slides on it, and as it turns, it's gonna turn this brush, this roller brush you see right here. If you wanna remove this belt, what you do is take your brush, just pull it out the assembly, and you're gonna take your finger and just slide it off the motor, and now you have your belt. Uh, oftentimes, this belt is gonna be broken inside of here, so you can just simply pull it out. Now, let's say you wanna install the belt. You've got your new belt, you wanna install it. First thing you do, take the side of your belt and slide it over the motor. So you want to slide it over so it looks like that. So once you've got the belt slid on the motor piece, you want to stretch the belt out. You want to take this belt, put it onto the brush, and then you're going to have to stretch the belt out. This brush has notches on each, each of the sides, so you want to make sure that you fit this brush into the groove so that the notches line up. And I'll show you that right now. So here are the notches I talked, I mentioned to you. You want to make sure that this part slides into that notch. And on the other side, see how it's shaped in such a way where that notch has to slide into the groove. So let's do that right now. Let's pull it out again. Turn this around and make sure that notch slides in that groove. And there you have it. We've just installed a belt on an upright vacuum cleaner. Last step would just be to take your screws and put your cover back on and you're done. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, hit that subscribe button and click that bell so anytime we drop a new video, you'll be the first to know. Hit that like button and leave me some comments. I'd love to hear from you. If you're interested in any of the products we used in today's video, we'll leave some links down below. Hope you have an awesome day. 
Thanks for watching.